Hey everybody, this is Adrian, Panda Maru Draws on Instagram, and I just wanted to show you guys the sketchbook I just completed. So I'm going to talk through this one, so let's get started. So front page, nothing special. Um, for February, I decided I was going to do fan art February, so every day of February I just did like a little doodle. I didn't want to make it into like a huge thing. Um, also, a lot of the stuff I was reading in college kind of got mixed into this, so I'll have a little out of his comic, and then quote the Raven, some Steven Universe fan art, Groundhog's Day. Uh, there's a dragon and a doodle of both of my doggy doos. Also, some more Steven Universe fan art down at the bottom. So the sketchbook started falling apart and I had to get it bound. Um, and so they had to cut off like an inch at the bottom. So that's why some of the pictures may look a little weird. I just put some washi tape around that Sansa one and uh, some Pokemon babies. I might, I might finish coloring those. It was nice to do. some Charmanders from uh, Pokemon Snap when you can throw apples at them. It's always been my favorite part. Then uh, Dr. Facilier back to my fan art February. A couple of drawings of people I know in real life. And then um, a comic. If you're on my Instagram, you've seen this one before, but it just says I'm a shroomish on a desk. And this is the news. Shroomish. I'm out in the forest asking the question on everyone's mind. Where the fuck are my berries? I just feel like whoopers would have a single mindedness and it would be about swimming and food. Here's back to some fan art. These were, this was kind of some, some poo days, seven and eight, but that's okay. Nine too, if, if we're being, if we're being honest. A tiny loot from Fire Emblem for number 10. Um, there's two 11s because I got drunk and did 11. And then when I sobered up, realized that that can't be. So I redid it. That's supposed to be Edward from Twilight. Hence all the sparkles. Some more kind of like not great ones. Cassandra Goth from The Sims 2 and then Tall Birds from uh, the video game Don't Star. Hidden Daft Punk for number 20. And this is me trying to, um, oops, oh gosh, let me put the camera down you guys, I'm sorry. This was me trying to do men's faces because I'm not, I'm not very good at it. So it's, it's pretty hit and miss honestly with every, with all faces. I'm still learning, you guys. There's nothing wrong with that. Um, Bioshock. And it's just, he's, he's shouting bees and his phone, his little recorder radio thing just says, get him with the bees, boy. And then, um, Gravity Falls and Rizzo from Greece. Because Greece is the world. I don't know if you guys were aware. A combi for president because I mean you you know what you get he he want to make honey for the queen and I think I think we can use that kind of kind of upfrontness some over the garden wall ones some poop body sketches. And um, number 28 was were snitches for Dr. Seuss because I love Dr. Seuss. And then I decided I was going to do March Monster Madness, but don't believe the hype because I didn't do it. I did these two and then I stopped. A 
Ooh, there's a kitty cat in here somewhere. I was trying to draw old time dresses. This is me practicing heads again. And here's one of the places where you can really tell that it, it got cut off. I made that guy up there ugly and I didn't mean to. So I wrote on his face. Um, Star Butterfly. Harry Potter with a giraffe neck. Oh, Hermione Granger sketch. I was trying to do a quick Nicki Minaj one. I think the only thing that really looks like her is her butt though. And then um, Darling Charming. I really love Ever After High. I know I'm a grown woman, but I don't care. Louise Belcher. I was going to try and enter the, the Bob Burgers fan art thing, but I, I misread when the contest was over. So by the time I had started, I think I had like one day left. So that didn't, that didn't turn out well. Um, a centaur lady with a really like fat horse body. I was trying to do a self portrait and just get better with the uh, colors and, and values. My friend requested me <laughs> drawing Tony Stark and Harry Potter making out, so there you go. Um, and then just like some, some just doodles. The next page is a mess. It's like paper on top of paper on top of paper. And then me trying to do some torsos. Some more just doodles. I realized that that arm and leg look exactly the same. This is from the Inspire Me uh, crates that they send. They always send a booklet that has a whole bunch of suggestions for each day. And some of the uh, suggestions are just hilarious and really good. So I decided to tape it in just in case I ever got stuck. I could just look over there today. This is oil pastel down here I really love rainbow quartz if it hasn't been obvious throughout this this is me trying to draw an only pen and the only thing I like is um the little spider made out of squiggles working on a commission that I owe somebody this is my prep for mermaid I've got all the things written down. I'm gonna try and do them. It, it's gonna be interesting. This is watercolor. And then here's some of the watercolor sets I own. And then this was, these are all um, burnt siennas, but I mean, you like, depending on who you get it from, you can see the, the complete and total differences in color. Another baby face. Um, just some more doodles. This is um whenever I get like new art supplies, I just I just test them out and then there's like a tiny Cersei drawing in the corner. What I wish Belle's stress from Beauty and the Beast would have looked like. Oh my gosh, you guys, there's a chipmunk outside. Can we can we film him? Do you see him? Okay, back to the sketchbook. Um, just some more just sketches. Nothing really going on. This one, I, I was pushing through some art block and I liked it at the time, but now just looking at it, I can see like all the things wrong with it. But I guess that's part of getting better is just noticing your mistakes and all that and that. Same thing, just still trying to just push through that art block. Mermaid practices for mermaid. And a little fishy do, cause you know, yeah. Also a mess. I made her head way too big, and then I tried to fix it with a whole bunch of sticky notes to to mixed effects. Oh, me trying to figure out my schedule for next semester. And uh, that's it. There's two pages left, but honestly, when I'm when I'm done, I'm done, you guys. And that's me being done. So thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. Bye.